uh, kind of at its worst from the dinner hour through to around dawn tomorrow. That's when we're going to see most of the accumulation. The system moving already across Michigan and southwestern Ontario. So through the day, you'll start to see that freezing rain move in. For us, it will be a late afternoon, evening and overnight event. And uh, the mix of snow and uh, ice pellets, uh, the ratio will, will be significant in terms of accumulation. The more ice pellets we get, the more dense, the lesser the accumulations. But still, an intense storm. Uh, if it remains uh, cool aloft on the surface in most layers and we get more snow than ice pellets without the melting, uh, it could be significantly more snow. So we continue to track this. Currently, we're under a winter storm warning. Uh, but if we see more accumulation uh, looking to be come in with this storm system in terms of just straight snow, it'll likely be upgraded to a snowfall warning. But not yet. Uh, Environment Canada makes those calls. Tomorrow, we're seeing everything pull back and we're going to see light precipitation linger through Thursday. Still a bit dicey because we could be seeing those flurries at times mixed with freezing drizzle on your Thursday. Things definitely die down on Friday, but cool down dramatically. Minus 2 today, minus 2 tomorrow, minus 6 on Friday, down to minus 15 Saturday morning. A chilly start to the weekend with some scattered flurries and then a quick recovery on Sunday and Monday. So much so that by Monday afternoon, we're likely going to get periods of moderate rain. And that's going to create lots of ponding and pooling as things get melted.